Today we're looking at harmony. Take a listen to this. Bye bye love. Bye bye happiness. Hello loneliness. I think I'm gonna cry. This is an example of two part harmony where one person sings the melody or the tune of a song. And another person accompanies them singing a higher part or a lower part, which is the harmony. Together they sound something like this. Now this is the simplest example of two-part harmony where both singers track each other. They both go up together and down together. This is tight two-part harmony. Now take a listen to this. This is a slightly more complicated example of two-part harmony. Let's play Paul's part first. And then John's part, which is lower this time. So they don't track each other. They do a bit, but not all the time. Let's put them both together. So there's some examples of two-part harmony. And now let's look at three-part harmony. And this is usually where you have one person singing the melody or tune to a song in the middle and another person singing a higher harmony and one singing a lower harmony. Now the vocal intro to Abba's Super Trooper does in fact have three parts even though there's only two girl singers. So with the use of a piano roll I'll show how this is made up. So here is the piano roll to just the tune part of Super Trooper. And the piano is on the left there and you can see what this sounds like. Now, this in purple is the higher part, the high harmony. And let's just see what that sounds like. And if we put them both together, they sound like this. Now let's look at the low harmony and see what that sounds like. Now this is what all three parts look like on the piano roll and let's just hear what this sounds like. So that's an example of three-part harmony, the melody in orange, the high harmony in purple and the low harmony in green. And now with help from our a cappella quartet you can hear what four-part harmony sounds like. If you go down to the woods today you're sure of a big surprise. If you go down to the woods today you better go in disguise. Now, when you get to four-part harmony, there's usually one melody line, the tune, and three harmonies. 
and the melody line can be anywhere in the range. In this particular example, it's right at the top of the range. And when you get four people singing together, they usually split into four groups called S, A, T and B, soprano, alto, tenor and bass. Now the soprano is at the top, alto and tenor are in the middle of the range and bass is right at the bottom. Let's have a listen to the soprano of Teddy Bear's Picnic. Mm. Now let's add in the first harmony, which is the alto. And now let's add in the second harmony, the tenor. And finally add in the third harmony or the bass. Now looking at the piano roll for this, it's much more complicated and spread out than the Super Trooper version. So this is a lot more rich and more harmonious. So I hope this has been a gentle introduction to harmony and what it's made up of. Six o'clock, their mummies and daddies will take them home to bed because they're tired little teddy bears. Da -da -da -da.